Hey guys, it's Valak here. I just wanted to give you a quick update and also to show you that 10 route that uh, I promised in the last video. And um, a little quick look at the gear here. There's nothing too special. You know, show you everything, uh, supplies and whatnot. I've been working on it a little bit, but I haven't been playing too much. Uh, skills, only thing less than three is alchemy and herbalism. Uh, I think I'm right on par with where I should be. So. The first ore is right here where I'm flying. There's a lot of people on right now, so you know you got to deal with what you can. And second ore would be here, but I feel like you know uh, I, I haven't actually calculated how many ores per hour, but each run takes me roughly five minutes, and I think I, I accumulate um, basically 60 ore, uh, 60, yeah, 60 ore and 30 crystals per run so you multiply that and whatever the hell it is you come out to so third one would be here and also this is um the name of the place I can't remember yeah well I mean if you if you're around my level or actually a lot lower then you already know where this is because we, you have to quest here at some point I think through the low 40s which is when I decided to try to find a route to, to upgrade my skills so if you follow my exact route then you should expect I don't know, roughly a few hundred um, probably about 500 per hour I would think which allows you to make five so roughly a hundred and fifty blacksmithing um, experience per hour if you use the uh, the tin ore maybe, maybe a little more I, I don't know anyways so yeah I just figured I would show this route because well I haven't seen any definitive guides and I mean if you know a better route definitely show me or um you know message me in game my name is Valak and uh yeah so yeah I, I might make you know uh a few more small guides on the uh, the other things that I uh, that I've been working on and I need to find a good herbalism route uh, herbalism herbalism so there's one here it's not there obviously but yeah so if I make you know a few herbalism guides or, or you know different ores and stuff and and uh, keep in mind guys that I, I haven't spent any money and there's one where this guy's AFK and at and if you put on auto attack you can sit there and if no one kills you then every time that ore spawns you'll mine it so a lot of people tend to do that you know that sort of thing and you'll see it quite often at the uh, third spot that was in the video, uh, fourth spot. I'm sorry. And uh, but basically, all you have to do here is just follow my route exactly, and you should be pretty set. And like I was saying, I haven't spent uh, one penny even on blacksmithing to get it to where it is. Uh, with the rare ore and everything, you just kind of oh god, oh, I'm out of breath. <laughs> uh, you know you spend you don't spend anything you get enough um, melt stones because those are those are the deal breaker here but um, all of the mythic gear that I'm wearing um, except for the scythe I got that through <laughs> believe it or not the the subjugation quest that just do themselves I got my my mythic weapon oh I me mean my um, legendary weapon or whatever the hell they called and I still don't know but um, so everything else though that I'm wearing I, I made it myself so th there's that you know there's the benefit of it and I haven't spent any any uh, real life money on this game because I don't want to and I feel like if I do uh, I'll definitely let you guys know because in a way it's cheating in a way it's not because I know a lot of people do it there's no way in hell that I could imagine that a level 20 could be in the full tier one um you know mythic set and if, if they are and you did do that legitimately well then grats because i've been doing instances <laughs> since level 11 when i first could and uh i haven't gotten a single mythic piece from it i don't know if i'm just unlucky or if i have a huge dry streak or what the hell's happening there but i haven't gotten anything so it's pretty bad but maybe I should buff that to at least, you know. I mean, if you're going to do dungeons forever, then you should be able to get a mythic piece within, you know, probably 
20 runs, I'd say, and I've done at least 20 of pretty much every one. Uh, maybe they should, you know, add like a log on that, you know, st statistically speaking. Uh, anyways, guys, this was the, uh, the the run here, and then from this last one, you just kind of fly over. I kind of get lost here for a second, but you fly back to the little, uh, to the first little ore place, and from there you are all set. You're all there that you just repeat the process, and yeah, it's been about five minutes, so. Thanks guys. If you want anything else, just let me know. Don't forget to like and subscribe.